video here while I'm here. In a 69 Cadillac crew of gasoline, he was home. <laughs> started off as our PR30. It took me a long time to do it. I've hated condensers for 50 years and I finally did something about it. We built large diaphragm dynamics with 40 dB a rear. That's why we have so much side entrance. It's not two little bitty holes like everybody else. It's a whole panel so we can get tremendous rears. Well, we cut the top off and we have a very small four inch PR30. It sounds exactly like it. it has 40 dB a rear. It's an amazing microphone. It's the best guitar microphone that I've ever heard and we've got just tons of artists using it for guitar, Steinway piano, underheads. We can get rid of all this garbage above with condensers four feet away from a cymbal. What the hell? Out. You're picking up the whole band. I don't want to pick up the band. I want to pick up a cymbal. You can do that with the PR31 BW. It's amazing for overhead and now underhead. And it, it, it's, it's a whole new, whole new way that you mic drums today. Then you take that, put it on top of a snare, put a PR22 under out of phase. It is absolutely the best sounding snare I've ever heard. The 22 has a rise at 4K. I did that for articulation for vocals and hard rock and roll singers. And the 22 is amazing because the snares resonate at 4K. So you put that under, you put the 31 over, wow. And you're not going to hear the tom right next to it because of its 40 dB of rear. That's what's freaking everybody out. They're using them for toms, and it's like they don't hear the guy beside him. They don't hear the hi-hat. They don't hear the cymbal, although it's only a foot away. And there again, it's our ingenious way of using phasing in the best way we can. No other manufacturer is to bring you that 40 dB of rear. That's, uh, that's our whole story, is being able to use science and technology, not a bunch of marketing hype. It's a real deal, and it's a real product. I hope you get to hear it, use it, and purchase it real soon. PR31 VW, that's the microphone of Nashville. 